Hi guys, your geeky OG-san here, and I'm not dead. This channel's not dead. Surprise to everyone. I know, I've been pretty inactive for a while. Um, basically, I had a series of family emergencies happen this year. Um, everybody's fine now, but uh, it was a big deal at the time, and, you know, it took up a lot of my time. Um, I also got a promotion at my day job, so I've been working a lot more lately, and unfortunately that hasn't really left me a lot of time to be creative. Um, I have been working on a few things. Uh, I do have some footage of me starting another doll custom. Uh, it's another male doll, uh, and I guess I'll pop some of that right here maybe. If I can figure out how to do that in my in my video editing software, um, I'm not sure when that'll be up, but I, it is in the works. Um, and I've also been drawing a lot more. Um, I asked for a lot of Copic markers for Christmas, so I guess we'll see if Santa provides on that one. I, I do draw and I do paint and a whole lot of other things. So if anybody ever wants to check out my artwork, you can find it at uh, www.deviantarts.com slash Azriel, A-Z-R-I-A-L, uh, dash S-H-I-O-N. I think that's the URL. If not, I'll put the correct one on the screen. Um... Uh, I've also... I also worked quite a bit on my... Uh, Merman Tale. Uh, I've gotten quite a ways on it. I still have quite a way to go, but uh, I will show you some of that now. Yeah, so last time you saw this tale, it was... Uh, it was not quite this far along. I think I only had the molds made, and I hadn't made any castings at all. Um, so this is the fluke. Um, it is two pieces uh, that will be stuck together, and there will be a monofin uh, in the middle, sandwiched in between, to give it a little stiffness so I can propel myself through the water. Um, up here I have the body of the tail, I guess you could say. Um, this is obviously going to be the top piece where I blend the scales into my skin, and then I just have a bunch of sheets of scales and scales and uh, and then I've got the belly plate because I wanted to do something that looked like a lobster um, over here we have my test uh, casting for my dorsal fin and as you can see uh, not the right color it doesn't really match all that well so I redid it. Um, these guys are stuck together. Uh, they do have a little bit of seaming that I need to address still, but it is coming along. I think they turned out pretty cool looking. Um, and over here I've got some little extra pectoral fins, maybe, I don't know, heel fins. I was going to use some of these for two. Uh, and these guys are stuck together now, too. And I just left this part blank because it's going to be cemented down anyway. You won't see the back. Um, here I have, like, a color test for what I want to do. And it's interesting because this reads a lot more blue in my, uh, in my viewfinder than it does in real life. It is actually more on the purple side, so I am surprised that this is showing up as metallic blue as it is. But maybe that's just how it reads on camera. Um, and then I've got like a variety of mica powders. Like, this is blue. This is the color. Oh, geez, it does look blue on camera, but this is the color, and as you can see, reflex violet. Um, I've got some hollow glitter I was thinking about incorporating somehow, some way. Uh, I have this cool powder. Uh, this is a duochrome. 
it changes from like a misty violet, a misty like a misty lavender to like a gold uh, or a brass, depending on how it hits the light. But it doesn't really show up that well unless you have it on something. Oh no, it's alive! So uh, I just basically all I have left is like assembly and paint, and I've already started the paint on the uh, on the fluke here. So. It's coming along, guys. Hopefully soon. <laughs> Alright guys, I know this was a short video. I just wanted to do something really informal, something uh, just to give you guys an update on what's going on. I noticed I've been getting some new subscribers lately, and I don't want them to think my channel's dead. Uh, unfortunately, I don't know that I'll ever be one of those channels that consistently releases, like, on a schedule, or however YouTubers manage to do that. Um, I have a day job, and uh, it gets in the way of this, unfortunately. But I can still be creative, and I can still do it when I can, and I hope you guys will stick around to see what I make. So in the meantime, uh, have a great holiday, everyone, whatever holiday you celebrate, and uh, I will see you guys later. Bye-bye.